So EA have decided to drop a brand new back to school promo in NBA Live Mobile. You got six 105 overall masters. Each of these guys are giving out plus three positional boosts. Looking great over there. They should be play style select if you get all six of them. And I'll go on to that a little bit later on. The grand master for this promo is a 107 overall small forward Kevin Durant. Giving out a plus three scoring machine boost to the team. And again, he is going to be a play style select grand master. I'll go through all the calculations with this promo. But let's kick things off by taking a look at the map itself. Now, this is a promo structure that we have had previously. You've got three separate sections. On the left-hand side is the finesse section. Down the middle is the power section. And on the right-hand side, it is going to be that strategic section. Each section runs exactly the same way. You're just gonna be getting different points depending on what section you are playing. So let's take a look at the right-hand side and an example. This is the strategic section. So you have a special event over here, which is gonna reset every 24 hours. It's gonna cost you 50 stamina to go ahead and play through. And each event will give you 300 points. Now on the left hand side of that, you will also get yourself a pack. And this is going to give you a guaranteed 83 to 93 overall player and a 10% chance of getting a 96 overall strategic player from the promo itself. And with this promo, it doesn't necessarily matter whether or not you actually go ahead and get yourself the 96. Every single 96 that you do pull from this pack will help yourself out and just get yourself the master a little bit quicker because it does save you those points. It's exactly the same for the other events. I've gone ahead and played through the power special event. So that's why it's not showing up as the rewards. I didn't manage to get myself a 96 overall player. I got myself a base player and those 300 points. Exactly the same for the finesse side. And each of these events will give you some monthly master emblems which might help yourself out, give yourself a final push to get those monthly masters for the month of August. To the left-hand side of that, you have got a Blitz event. So these are 15 events to play through daily, each one costing 25 stamina, again, giving out those monthly master emblems. And these ones are only going to give you 100 points. So this is the strategic one. So it's giving me 100 strategic points, the power one giving me 100 power points, and the finesse ones giving me 100 finesse points. All of these points will fill up the bar. As you can see, the max you can get up to is 100,000 points. You definitely don't need to get up to that if you want to get yourself the Grand Master. But what you do with those points is you spend them by pressing on the shopping cart icon. So if we press on the power one over here, you can see you're exchanging those points for 96 overall select packs. Now it does not matter at all what 96 you actually go ahead and select from this pack. And I'll go on to why in the sets later on. But these are going to cost 1,750 points. And they're basically there for each different section. It's exactly the same amount of points, just different ones. So this is the strategic one, same amount of points, but basically the same pack, but it is just going to be those strategic versions of the player. So that is the only place you are spending those points. You don't need to spend them anywhere else. That is what you're going to exchange those for. If we take a look at the sets, there are an extra way of you being able to get yourself some more points. And that is through these exchanges exchange sets. You need to exchange for 83 to 87 overall players. They can be past season players if you've got them still on your bench and that will give you 600 of those power points. This is going to reset every 24 hours. So you can see I've done it. It's got my cooldown on it as 23 hours, 45 minutes. So 24 hours is the cooldown for this set over here. So you can do it every single day. Very, very useful to get yourself a couple of more points here and there. Then there's exactly the same stuff for the strategic one, exactly the same players for 600 strategic points and exactly the same for the finesse side over here, getting yourself more and more points as you can then exchange for more and more 96 overall select packs. Now, the reason I said you don't need to get specific 96 overall players is because it's just requiring any 96 player from the power side, plus two 88 plus overall players. Again, you can put in past season players. It's up to you what players you put into the set. If you're struggling for players, look on the market, go into the trade up sets, try and do all of that stuff. And you should be able to have enough players to do this set as many times as possible. Through this, you will get yourself a 101 overall select pack. When you get the 101s, it is important which ones you pick. I'll go on to why a little bit later on, but it's exactly the same for the strategic section. As you can see, 296 strategic players plus 288 plus overall players gets yourself a 101 select pack and exactly the same for the finesse side over there. When you've got those 101 overall players, the reason why it is important which ones you select is because you need each one specifically once to be able to get yourself a 105 overall select pack. So this is for the power side to either get yourself Tracy McGrady or Patrick Ewan. It's exactly the same for the strategic side, just giving you those other masters, Kevin Garnett and Derek Rose. It's really nice to see that we got another Derek Rose card in the game. Then the final side over here to get yourself the finesse 105 overall masters. When you get these guys, they will be select. So you can pick up whichever one you want, but make sure you're getting the right 101s into this set to then get yourself the 105s out of it. Then when we go on to the grand master set to get yourself KD, you need all six of those 105 overall masters. Stick them in this set and you will get yourself Kevin Durant 
at playstyle select. Now, if you press on the information over here, you can see it gives yourself 107 Kevin Durant at style select and master return tokens. That means you won't get the 105s back necessarily from this set, but you can then exchange those master return tokens to get them at playstyle select. So once you've got those tokens from that set, you then go on to the final row of sets where you're exchanging the power token to get yourself the 105 Ewing and of course, Tracy McGrady, but this time at playstyle select. So you can pick whether you want them both at strategic, maybe you want both of them at finesse, both of them at power. You can then go ahead and select whichever one you want to choose of all of those masters. And it's exactly the same for the other two masters. So these are the strategic ones over here to get yourself those two at playstyle select and exactly the same ones for the finesse masters you then exchange them for whatever play style you want so don't worry when you're going ahead and sticking all six 105s into this set you will get yourself kd and you can also then exchange those tokens to get yourselves those 105s back at whatever play style you want so it's a very helpful promo to match as many players as you want in your lineup to that boost item that you have got in the store there isn't a huge amount which you can do but let's take a look at it either way you have got a coin pack or a watch ad pack five of those every single day each one giving you 200 of every single point so that's 200 power points 200 finesse points and 200 strategic points it's up to you whether you spend the coins or watch the advert it's only 10k coins 50k a day it's not a huge amount but of course if you're struggling to get stuff to sell as everyone are at the moment you can of course watch an advert because it's completely free if you scroll all the way down there is some cash offers so there's a boga one over here 200 nba cash for 1000 of each of the points boom or bus packs to try and get lucky enough to get yourself 101 overall players and there is also a vip event which does require you to spend real money to unlock if we go back to the events themselves it will give you a couple of extra things to do with the promo it's right here at the top in the middle of the promo and it's going to refresh every 24 hours it's not costing any stamina at all but it does give you a 10 percent chance of getting a 101 overall player and it's guaranteed a random 96 overall player so it's up to you whether you want to spend the money on that to try and get yourself some more players and get through the promo a little bit quicker there's also some bundles and all of that stuff if you want to go ahead and spend the money but in terms of calculations for this promo we're going to start things off with the set as to what it's required to get yourself that kevin durant so if we look at his set you need six 105 overall masters so that is two from each side of the map so now let's look at how many 101s you will need and each 105 requires five 101s to be able to get so that means to get yourself two 105s you need 10 101s from every single section so that's 10 strategic ones 10 finesse ones and 10 power ones then if we look at what it takes to get a 101 you need to get yourself two 96s per 101 overall master so that means you need 20 96s from every single side of the map and then to get your 96s you need to go ahead and exchange the points in this store icon to get yourself the 96 overall player so in total to get yourself 20 96s from every single side of the map you need to spend 35,000 power points, 35,000 finesse points, and 35,000 strategic points. So now we know exactly what you need to get yourself Kevin Durant. Let's work out how many points you're going to get throughout the promo itself. And through the special event, you will get yourself 300 points daily. Through the blitz event, you will be able to get yourself a total of 1,500 points every single day of every single section. Then through the sets themselves, of course, using that exchange set every day, you're getting yourself an extra 600 points. Through the store, either watching an advert or spending some coins, you will be able to get yourself a total of 1,000 points daily. If you add all of that up, that is 3,400 points you're getting every single day, not including any of the money offers you go ahead and spend or the NBA cash you go ahead and spend. That's 3,400 points daily. If we go and take a look at how long the promo is out for in total, it's out for a total of one week and five days. Of course, it doesn't show the hours, so it is one week and five days. So that means that it's a 12 day promo for you to go ahead and play through. 3,400 times 12, that is 40,800 points you're getting from every single section if you're doing everything I've just mentioned throughout the promo itself, which is well clear of the minimum, which is 35,000 points in order to get yourself Kevin Durant. So that does mean you might be able to miss a couple of days here and there, maybe miss some sets, miss some events, miss some stuff in the store. Of course, you could just play through the promo, get through it as quickly as possible by doing absolutely everything. And every single 96 overall player you pull from the special events does decrease the amount of points you actually need to spend in the respective stores, because of course you're getting a 96, you don't need to spend 1,750 points to get another one, if that makes sense over there. So KD ultimately is a free to play player. Let me know in the comment section down below whether you're gonna go ahead and get him but we did get a Derek Rose card in this promo and on 2k24 I did decide to go ahead and swap Derek Rose and Russell Westbrook's career which turned out to be a very very interesting couple of seasons if you want to go check out the full video it's in the bottom left hand corner and I'll see you guys in that one peace